Hey folks, it's JP. It's March 8th, 2014. It's the first swarm that I've had an opportunity to shake this season. Uh, last weekend, I ran a swarm out of a little bathroom between the bathroom ceiling and the, and the rooftop. But uh, they had moved in probably two days prior. So then we had a really cold front that set in and the bees hadn't been doing much anything and they've just been holding on and so we got a warm day which it warmed up into the mid 60s today and you can see what we got after I deal with this one I got another swarm of river ridge to deal with and the house behind me has an active colony in it. it's been in there a while and then the house next to it probably eight feet away has a humongous hive in there so we're going to deal with them another time but right now we're going to be getting into this swarm I hope you all enjoyed the video we're going to try to cage our queen like we normally do and uh, put her in the setup and by night time they should all be in our box. And I'll come back and I'll pick up the box, put it in my truck and then uh, maybe tomorrow or the next day I'll bring them to my bee yard. So we're going to get started. Alright, here we go. We got a little bit chill in the air, so hopefully uh, they're forgiving today and <laughs> not wanting to pop me. Remember last year, the, my first swarm was on a trampoline and I, it was cooler that morning. And they kind of lit me up a little bit, so hopefully these girls will uh, be gentle with me today. What I'm doing here, I'm just uh, I'm minimizing our numbers a little bit so I can try to spot that queen. See, they don't freak out and just start flying everywhere. They kind of just uh, run up the sides of your box. So and they'll, they'll stay tight for a few minutes. They actually will reorient to this box. And they're, they're going to fan and put, you know, orientated pheromone out. So uh, while I'm getting their numbers down, this is one way of doing that. And, uh, so we have less to look through up here. Yeah, we got the best look. Yeah, I'm not seeing her. She must be up there.
Alright folks, Queen's in the box. I didn't find her, but bees are clustering up tightly on the frames. And um, I have some, as you can see, some uh, some comb from a, a cutout, previous cutout, that I put in it doesn't fill the whole frame. So those, those gaps on either side of the comb, the bees are festooning heavily. So there's big balls of bees on several frames, and she's probably in one of those balls. And I don't want to go ahead and dig through them and, and, and break them up just to find her because I could in the course of trying to find her aggravate the bees enough to where they would leave the box but they're very content to be here and there's a little bit of, of a chill in the air and um, as the evening progresses the temperatures will drop a little bit more so to, so they should be all in the box when I get here come nightfall so first warm shake of uh, the 2014 season I hope y'all enjoyed it another one from JPDB man y'all have a good day because I sure am.